What's cooking? Welcome to What's Cooking on City TV. My name is Apioko. Now, today gets very special, and there's a reason for that. We're hosting a queen. We call her Her Majesty. And today she's going to take us through a whole spread, and she's teaching us how to prepare several different little pieces, bits and bites, when you're entertaining somebody at home. And I mean, I can't wait to see what she's going to do. I'm sure she's going to walk in flowing. This is her kitchen. I just asked her to allow me to introduce her because a queen must be heralded. So when we come back, we meet our queen and we get cooking. Welcome back. This is Still What's Cooking on City TV. If you just joined us, you don't know who I am. My name is Apioko. Now it's time to cook with the lady we call Her Majesty. Your Majesty, your kitchen awaits you. Hi, <laughs> Apioko, you're in my kitchen today. Yes, I am. I see you all over the place. This is Business Kai Loko. Welcome to my kitchen. Her local ship. So, like you said, Business Kai Loko. So, I get a lot of people I have to host every day, and um, I can't do it in long hours because i'm very busy with Extremely what i do busy. i don't know how you yeah do i run a news she's you know, a head of department. news at city fm and city yeah. tv she's at work before seven sometimes <laughs> you're doing business news on city fm 97.3 city fm you see her on cnr and, and then i also have to run a fashion house of course, so she's got kyla Nichols. yeah we're going to entertain i'm going to do about six dishes okay. you know these days a lot of people are watching their diet their mm -hmm. weight and all that so we're going to do two salads okay and they're going to be friendly salads mm -hmm. so it's easy to eat okay. and then we'll do um uh, prawn sauce mm -hmm. you can use shrimp as well we'll do some lamb chops mm -hmm. we'll do some sauteed potatoes uh, we'll do um, some couscous. Okay. You can use Gary if you don't want to do the couscous okay. thing. So we'll, we'll go English, we'll go the Mediterranean, come we'll go to come back to Ghana and all that. <laughs> we have a Shona. in Shona because of the you know the seafood. So we have seafood, we have lamb, we have um, um, quite a variety of things okay. to to okay. host our so guests. So proper surf and turf. Yes, yeah, yes. Cool. And we're, we're clocking less than an hour. Okay. Yeah. So, Abby, you know I'm a, a, a plant person. Oh, I so I have my rosemary, um, fresh. I like it fresh, but we'll use the dry ones. Trust Vivian. Fresh. S smell it. I want you to smell it. Mm. Gorgeous, it's isn't divine. it? It's divine. It's divine. Then we have the basil. Okay. Also, um, a cocoa smell mesa. It. Yeah, cocoa. Yeah. Or what the guys say. What's the guy? Um, I always forget the guy. Oh no, my guy! My guy! Because you know, will kill when you go me. to the market. It's always a um, they say. I so. remember. Don't worry. Yeah, it will come. So I remember. So with the rosemary, it works great with red meat okay. and all that. And this works great with um, the white meat. So okay. chicken. If you want the best chicken, this is it. Okay. If you want the best meat, steak, yeah. all that. This is so it. So aptly named akukomesa. Yes. <laughs> so that's it. And okay. then of course we have our peppers mm -hmm. here. We have garlic. I'm a freak with garlic. Mm. Garlic c can do magic. It, it can, can change. I agree form. with you. So I love garlic. So you see a lot of that. Tons of it. Permit me. <laughs> and then um, you have your onions. Okay. And these I are do, red onions. Yes, red. You can okay. do any onions for what I'm doing. It doesn't matter. Okay. Um, I love these two. I'm not a ginger fan, so okay. you wouldn't really see ginger in my house. I am. I'm like but you. But these two. And then my rosemary, my basil, and then the dried herbs. Okay. Yeah, there's thyme, there's rosemary. Okay. Um, so I see some anise there as yes. well. Some uh, yeah, so okay. and then red pepper, 
And then this is actually the kebab uh, powder. Mm. We'll, we'll play around with it with the um, lamb chops okay. at the point. So the kebab powder that we all know and love yes. that we buy from our yes. chichinga. Chichinga guy. You can, ah. get, you can call him to give it to you for free, which okay. is what my guy does for me. <laughs> and then I have the um, black pepper okay. and then um, and white, white pepper. Okay, so those are the full peppercorns. Yes, we'll okay. blend them, well, mash them nicely. Okay. Um, for Ooh. our lamb chops, we'll add a bit of brown sugar okay. just to give it a bit of kick. Okay. And then some turmeric, um, and then that should be fine, and okay. a bit of pepper to, right. to shift it a bit. Okay, so that's our dried red pepper. Yeah. The aquile wabi, which is dried. Yeah. The yeah. Yam pepper, yeah. and then yeah. Yeah. it's been ground. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And then that's And our then that's our couscous. Okay. Like I said, you can do the um, gari if you okay. don't want the couscous. Okay. Okay. Then we have mango. We'll go into one of our salads. Okay. And then we have um, cabbage, red cabbage, mm -hmm. and then aubergines, and baby okay. aubergines. All right. Yeah. Okay. And then we have some mixed salad here. And then we have spinach. I see the spinach. Yeah, spinach. We'll do some yeah. fun with it. And then, of course, we have our potatoes, some okay. eggs, flour. And these are Irish potatoes, these are not Irish, sweet potatoes. Yeah. But you, if you can use sweet potatoes, you can even use cassava if you okay. want. Okay. Maybe next time I'll just do local yeah. stuff, bougie local stuff. Uh, perhaps. <laughs> yeah. So that. And okay. then, can we go over there? Yes. And okay, then so we walk you through. Yeah. And then we have our um, cherry tomatoes mm -hmm. or baby tomatoes here. Okay. We have the fresh pepper. Yes. Which the I bonnet. love. Yes. Scotch bonnet peppers. And then um, you have some lamb sausages. Okay. Lamb sausages? Yes. So these are lamb. These are actually um, fresh made in Ghana. Okay. So we have lamb sausages. Yeah. And they're baby sausages. Yes. The small ones. Yeah. Okay. Very tasty. And then you have some um, prawns. prawns. Straight from the inshona. Straight from the inshona. Yeah. You if can do butter. shrimps as well. But I like the prawns because they are bigger. Yeah. More shrimps, meat. you know, more, more meat, meat over okay. there. So, so I think our local lemon. Yeah, our local. This is actually from the garden as well. This is from my uh, wow. that's fine. I'll pick it and up. You can trust me. Yeah. So let's start with the salads because okay. I need to get that lamp done. Okay. Let's so we we'll start with a lamp. Okay. We've washed them already, so no judging. No judging. No judging. No judging. So we just just cut it okay quickly so that we it gets the fire gets into it quickly we okay. don't have to wait forever okay. so any you know people like uh, chunks people like a whole whichever one it just to show that it's in there mm. that's all okay. so okay with that you can always change your mind and with maneuver this gym? no a real um, fine pan or something okay. just try this off so this should sit on the stove Cabbage looks good. Yeah. Oops. And then we add a lamb. Okay. A lamb sausages. Yeah, lamb sausages. Okay. Okay, just. This kind of um, sausage mm. takes a bit to cook. Okay. So you don't want high heat mm. and then it's done outside mm. but not inside. Okay. So. We'll leave that to do its own thing. We'll All come right. back to it later. Makes sense. Okay. So I think we can start um, 
the, the main salad for that. Okay. But I'm going to put some rosemary into okay. that. The fresh rosemary. The fresh, uh, the lamb okay. sausages at a point. Uh, just to get the okay. flavor there. So, okay. um, Let, let's allow this to, you know, okay. simmer a bit. We'll come okay. back to that. Right. So, um, we can start um, the, with the cherry tomatoes. Um, the second salad has um, eggs. We can put them okay. to the bring so, it to the so boil. So we're going to boil them. Yes. Okay. Great. The fridge. Yes. So I'll get another bowl. So we start making the second salad, okay. which is. And the first one is called mixed tomato okay, herbs. So So happy. Uh, Lam, did you try it? Yeah. Oh, did you so like good. it? Okay. Too so. good. So we're just gonna dump them in more? there. Yes, you can. I'll give okay, you some. so the lamb goes, uh, lamb, lamb goes, sausages go yeah. into into the, the salad, the mixed yeah. tomato. Yeah. So this will give us the protein and also. Okay. Those of us who like, so this is for you. All right. Thank you. So this is what I do. By the time this I'm done, yummy. I'm full. And you've eaten everything. I know. Sausage was so good. And this mm. looks very rich, right? It does. This can go with anything: garlic bread. Um, just this with some champagne This looks like wine. a million cities. I know, like, right? We could actually sell this online, yeah, auction it. That's a good idea. You know, travel around the world. A beautiful idea. Mm. <laughs> so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to add a bit of um, pepper. Okay. Because I'm ga mm. and I mm. like pepper. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to add that to the, um, what do you call it? The aubergines. Yes. So this also with the aubergine, it's up to you. Oh, that's it, very colorful. Yeah, very colorful. If you want it um, mm. soft, tender, people want it tender. People like it, you know, a bit crunchy. Mm. It's up to you. I don't mm. mind. Do you so like your so stuff? Just, well, I mean, a bit of crunch is great. Yeah. So you're just sautéing so the aubergine it to in give the it same sauce. In the same sauce. Okay. So I'm not wasting any okay. sauce. And it's the same garlic and onions, the flavor and all that. Get ready for the second one. So with this one, we're gonna add mango. Aha! Uh -huh. Now I'm not a big fan of mango. Oh no! But why I will did I eat think it. you were? I will eat it. Mango goes nicely with this sausage. Okay.
here. So this is a salo mango. It's the bigger mango. Yes. But we have our smaller ones. Yeah, you know, you know those ones, um, it's difficult to dice them. Mm. Because, because they're, they're, they're soft. soft yeah. yeah. But if you can, people do, are doing all sorts of things <laughs> of now. Course. If you can dice okay. them, I mean, uh, okay. it's fine. So it's, these ones work better for a salad. Yeah, okay. this works better for okay. a salad. Right. So I think this is enough. Okay. So let me dump this. Okay. So just two wedges in yes. there. Okay. So let's mix it up and see if it's okay. fine. Let me check on our eggs. So we're going to take a break. Ladies and gentlemen, when we return, we finish our red cabbage salad and then look at what else we have on our spread today. We'll be right back. City TV is live on DSTV. Go to channel 363 on Go TV. Access City TV on channel 182. On a digital TV, please press the menu button on the remote control and run a new search on your TV. Take note that without an antenna, you cannot access City TV on your television. City TV can be accessed on a free to air digital box like the Go TV and Star Times box. City TV, it's your world. Welcome back. This is Still What's Cooking on City TV. And I'm cooking with business Kai Loco. So for the potatoes, I'm just going to do saute potatoes. Okay. 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 Have you noticed I've not used salt so far? Yes. Okay, so that's why I have a slightly salted butter. Okay. To do most so of the salt the thing. Work. Yes, I don't okay. really use, you know, because of health reasons. So, okay, I'm just going to add a bit of butter okay. to both. To the water? Yeah, the water for hmm. the two. Interesting. And um, so to, to make our couscous more fluffy. Okay. And then the butter to give it a bit of okay. some kick. You really are a butter girl. I told you butter you and did. garlic. You did. So that's it. Okay. So, so those are it, your secret weapons. Yeah. So we learn that. Okay. And then we do that. So while we're waiting for that, let's marinate our lump. Okay. So here. there they are. So it's very simple. I'm going to... Since, I mean, usually I'll do it overnight, oh. so the, you know, the juices of oh. the garlic and the, uh, what do you call it, onions are in there. Oh. But because we didn't do that, the trick to it is to get a fork. Okay, so we need a fork. Yeah. Here? Yeah. No? Okay. And then make great holes in there just to get the um, spices okay. in there nicely. Okay. Since we don't want to spend the whole day here, so you just add your garlic in there. Okay. All right. And then 
Okay. Yeah. Okay. My husband was telling me the more you add the um, onions and the garlic for this, mm. it takes more for it to cook because they block its mm, weight. The pores. And I was like, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Also to fast track the marinating of mm. our lamb, I'm going to freeze it a bit. And you know, the, with the butter for the couscous, it makes it fluffy. Okay. So that's why. So that's, so that's the reason yeah, for the butter. That's the reason okay. for the more fluffy. So I think we can dice um, um, some peppers. Some pepper. Okay. <laughs> The other thing too is what they're seeing on camera may not actually be what we're that, adding. That's actually yes. true. So it could be magnified, it could be diminished. So just to let our viewers know that we're that's, thinking that's about That's very them. true. Yeah. Okay, so um, we just have to let this tool boil. Okay. And our lamb is in the fridge. Should we start the prawn sauce? Yes, absolutely. Okay, okay if so we have space. Here. Okay. Okay, so how's the salt in the couscous? So it's fine, and um, I saw that you put just a pinch in yeah. there. Yeah, and remember, we'll still do, we'll do a bit of like a, um, some spices and all that, and we'll okay. saute again. Okay. So, so it'll be like a fried rice. Okay. Sorry. Kind so of don't thing. worry. We'll. Okay. We'll. So I think right. this is fine. We'll just let it sit. So if we're doing this with Gary, it will be like a bougie Gary photo. I know. Uh -huh. okay. Because we'll just toss it quickly and move on with okay. our lives. So let's start the, the um, sauce. Okay. Um, sauce. We're doing all so that. So I think we here. need some space. Um, we need a bigger a bigger pan. pan. Okay, so let me find one. Let me move this over here. Since since you've taken over my already. kitchen, let's see whether you find a pan. Hmm. And this a big test one. that you're giving me, dear. Okay. Can this one work? Yeah, this is fine. It's big, but it should be fine. So we'll give it space. Okay. Well, at least you have space. Yeah. So. Let me see. Better, yeah, bigger than fine. smaller. Yeah. Okay. So, so we rinse this off. Where is that? I like the way the couscous is looking. I feel I, like I, I have like, a I like the way it already. Get out of Very the house. Cute. Yes. So yeah. let's. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's so try that. Mm. I like it, right? Okay. I have taught you a habit, oh, which is eating as you go. No, I'm not even. <laughs> I'm not even trying to give you hype or anything like that. But mm -hmm. I've had couscous several times. Never have I tasted it this good. Yeah. And this is not even hype. I'm being honest no, with you. No, it's not. All right. So okay, so well we have to dice our, um, our onion. Okay. Just, Onions. Okay. You're just doing it chunks. Okay. That's it. Okay. This is it. You just have to. If the, the um, tough part is there, you just take it off so that they can fall okay. nicely. No long things. No long things. So I did a bit of oil and then, um, what do you call it? Butter. Okay. And just so chuck put this. in there. So we can get the juices out. All right. Nicely. So. Okay. Butter is a star in this. It's the star. You know, star of the day. Star of the day. It does so much, but it has to be the right one. So let's allow this to. Okay. And then, while we're waiting it for it to simmer, not so much because I like my onions Crunchy. chatting with me. So. Okay. And then we need um, a bit of pepper, which we have there. I'll okay. come back and. The blend. But let pepper. me get some carrots. And okay. So we, should, we just need to. I hope the people who need to listen are listening. Well, you thought you could run away from Vivian. I mean, it's not what the papers are saying. 
Vivian's <laughs> View, CNR, yeah. Vivian doing some cutting edge interview. Yeah. But she still got you in my What's Cooking Kitchen. I know. Mm. But it's hard to get VK at home. Like, a lot of the time yeah. she's on the move. So I knew she had a weekend off. Mm -hmm. You know. So let me get this thing higher. Oh, God, our potatoes. Okay. We nearly forgot. Okay. I hope it's so not they're all done. Okay, let me bring the cola in here. It's soft, but we'll manage it. So I'm going to add the pepper. Okay, to this. that's the blended green pepper. Mm -hmm. so, and then we have the pepper in there as well. Okay, so yes, you can and the onions. Yeah, the onions. Yeah, the chunky onions. The chunky onions. So I'm going to put the carrots. carrots in there. Okay. I, I don't like washing, so you notice that when I cut, I don't put it in a bowl. I just pick it and throw yes. it in to reduce, reduce the, the, the work. Number of, <laughs> it is a lot of things you have to wash. I mean, because you insisted that people need to know the proportions, that's why I put it in. But if mm. I was doing it, everything, I just can't put it. Wash, that's cut, it. Yeah, and that's it. Yeah, I mean, cooking shouldn't be such a chore, yeah. right? You should love what you're you should doing. love what you're doing. Love it while you're cooking it and love it more while you're eating it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you know... Um, Onions are funny, and oil can be funnier. So it's always better to fry it in. Like if you have um, oil, you fry it with the onions to boost it. Okay. I didn't do that with the latest. What I'll do is I'll put I'll add some onions okay. to kick it up. Okay. So those who really are into it, they'll judge me. But, uh, they, yeah, but we don't care. We don't care. <laughs> I mean, we love you, but we don't really care. <laughs> so I think we can start our potatoes, right? Okay. Yes. Is it on? Yes, it's on. Okay. Okay. So, butter. Butter. Almighty. Almighty butter. The superhero. Yeah. Come to save the day once again. Yeah. Okay. And then a bit of. It seems like we're almost through with our dishes. Yeah, we're almost done, right? Because you know, we've done. Okay, our eggs are here. Yeah, we'll just so peel them and then. For the last one, so our. Red cabbage salad is pretty much done. You need to put the yeah. eggs on there. We've already finished with the our tomato one, and herb yeah. mixed salad. That's already sitting pretty. Pretty somewhere in the in dining the area. Okay. Then our couscous is here. Yeah. Then our prawn sauce mm -hmm. is on the fire. Sauteed potatoes are on the fire. And the last thing, oh, the lamb. Okay, so that's the last the thing. Lamb, that that's to go. yeah, the last thing. Yeah. Okay, so you added just a bit of yeah. olive oil to, yeah. to the butter. To the butter. Okay, so for the sauteed potatoes, both butter and olive oil, yes. virgin olive oil. Yes. I'm adding okay. some thyme as well. Okay. I've added a bit of thyme to the um, the prawns. Okay. So okay. a bit of thyme in there. Okay. Okay. Let me let it simmer a bit. Okay. Yep. Good. Photographic memory <laughs> serves me good. Okay. Serves you right. Okay. okay. So I'm going to take a bit of the peas and put them here. I just want to give it some color. Okay. We need to drain them, I guess. Yes, please. I'll just do that in here since potatoes are gone. I'm just going if you to want add. to go the long route, you can go and harvest them yourself. And oh, yeah. Whatever. I think this, this shade is at me. And I take strong exceptions to that. It's not my fault I have a garden. No, we love you for your gardening skills. So I'm just going to add, we've already put some pepper in there, but, you know, you know that the seed is what makes it hot, right? Yes. So I'm going to put in there. Okay. I hope. So you want to expose the seeds. I seat. want to expose the okay. seeds and... Make it more hotter. Okay. And then I'm going to put in some, some water. a bit of basil just to give okay. it. Okay. Okay. Some... Straight from the pot? Yes. Yeah. 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 So there you go. And our spinach. Ooh. The yeah. basil is just jumping out of the pot. Wow. This is me always tasting the stuff. The flavor is so delicate. Mm -hmm. It's I, you think that for all the things that are in there, you'd have a very strong taste, but it's so delicate where you can actually separate the Blended flavors. Nice Wonderful. Stuff. Okay, so I've put the eggs on okay, the on the, sal the salad. Yes, the yeah. red cabbage salads, and I've, you know, 
just pushed it over okay. to the dining area. Okay. So that's out of the way. So our um, shrimp sauce is done, actually. Okay. We're just going to firm up the sauce. So we add a bit of um, flour okay. just to firm it, not too much. Okay. So the flour mixture goes straight in. Yeah. Okay. But okay, I see you're putting it in a bit at a time. Yes. Okay. Yeah, I think it's fine. It's fine? Yeah. Okay. So should we start on our lamb? Let me add a little more. I don't like it so thick. Thick. Mm -hmm. It then becomes a pudding. Okay. <laughs> so because you just want it more yeah. saucy than yes, soupy. Yeah. Okay. Saucy. Okay. So we're done with the flour. Yeah. Then. Okay. So let me let me take it to the other room. Yeah. Okay. It's not non-stick. Yeah. So. Should we lower it a bit? Mm -hmm. okay. So because it's cooked already, we don't need to. Kill ourselves over okay. that. We just have to add a bit of garnish in to give okay. it color. We're fine. We're fine. Okay. Yeah, that's right. All right. Okay. So, can we get the lamb out? Yes. Okay. It's in the fridge. Okay, so we can start our alarm. Alarm. Okay. 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 So let's let it heat up a bit. Okay. You can get about four in there. Yeah. That's a time. Okay. Okay. Good. Pan all set. Yeah. Okay. So we go to the fire. Okay, so that's our couscous pan. Yeah. Okay. It's already ready. We're just adding our veggies to it. Okay. So it's not going to be a, a long day affair. Okay. So our lump is getting ready. You can see the blood coming out. I can out. smell it. It smells great. Yeah. Okay, so at this point, I think we could possibly go for a break. So couscous is going to go back onto the fire. We're going to add some sweet corn, some peas. Yeah. What else? Uh, a bit of a uh, little pepper. Okay. A green one. Green peppers. Okay. And then we'll call it a day. So when we come back, we sit down and we enjoy this spread with our guests. We'll be right back. This is what's cooking on City TV. City TV is live on DSTV. Go to channel 363. On Go TV, access City TV on channel 182. On a digital TV, please press the menu button on the remote control and run a new search on your TV. Take note that without an antenna, you cannot access City TV on your television. City TV can be accessed on a free to air digital box like the Go TV and Star Times box. City TV, it's your world. Welcome back, and it's time for the fun part, the best part on what's cooking the eating and the conversations. And today, I've been cooking with her local ship business, Kai Loco, Vivian Kai Loco, my mama. Hello. And look, I mean, you, you say, when you say you've cooked up a storm, this one, she's cooked up a hurricane. Thank yeah. you. This ain't no storm. It's a hurricane. Mm -hmm. And of course, Blowing I... Blowing over oh, oh, a Lord, crab. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. <laughs> and and I, I mean, Vivian, I did tell you that I was inviting two guests. The other couldn't make it, unfortunately. But Magdalene, friend, sister, model, Good. Model extraordinaire is here. I mean, when we talk about contemporary modeling, when it became commercial, see, she's second generation. I'm so, told she's the, the Naomi Campbell of Ghana. Of course, Anabraka Branch. Oh, thank you. Ghana's ancestor. Go ahead, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> 
<laughs> wow. You know, in camp. And I must say, Mama, your, your garden is Yes, yes, beautiful. yes, yes. It yes. seems like every time I come here, it grows more There's something and more lush. new, right? So what are we seeing? So we have um, cassava, we have okay. the cocoa yams, we have the corns, we have the mm. coconut. We have what we say in Ga'alu Gwintu 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 Pepper okay. and all sorts. Okay, so VK, we, we made. So these we are made um, our mixed um, herb salad. Okay. We have our cabbage salad. Mm -hmm. We have our couscous. Mm -hmm. We have our sauteed potatoes. We have our shrimp sauce, and then we have our lamb chops. Okay. That's a lot. I mean, it's your table. Could you kindly serve yes, us, I Madam can Hostess? Serve. Oh. Madam you Hostess. Guys, um, let me get out of this. Okay. Okay. So, you want to start with the salads? Yes, I yeah. that's fine. Okay, so, I'm going to okay. give you a bit of each. So, this is our mixed yeah, herb, this is our mixed tomato herbs. and herb. Yeah. And we've got the lamb sausages in there. Yeah. Mm. Look at that. It's you don't mind me using the same Oh, no, cutlery. absolutely not. No mm. allergies a to A bit either. of cheese. Okay, I know Magni is allergic to pineapple, but not to mango. So no, we're not I love mango. Is oh, this right. a salad mango? Yes, yes. This I would have currently given you the invite me. <laughs> this is just. This is you, like. right? It's so me. It's so, and I see. Some, is it shrimp or love? Yes, it's like some prawns. Prawns. Yes. Yes. I love it. So you, you are not into too much eating, right? No. Okay. You, no, you, she you might. As, so as you can see. Yeah. You can see from your keeping, figure. Keeping the figure. She's modelesque. We hate you. I love you. Any little thing we eat, we grow fat. So. I mean, you just okay. smell food and you go fast. Yeah, it's so okay. you just have to smell it. The garnish and us. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so that's okay, that so one. So we should go through the salad and then come back. Yes. Okay. I hope it's wonderful. not too filling for you, especially mm. Maggie, mm -hmm. the I model. Try. A small I portion. Try and, so. Yeah. Okay. okay. So that's um, good. we can start with that, and then we quickly. Okay. I'll just. Uh, so there's some wine as well. Yes. Okay. So I want to try this. That's good day good energy day. drink. Um, I've heard yes, so it's much the about energy it. drink to drink. Yes, it doesn't taste like your quintessential energy drink. I okay. mean, that's not even trying to make it sound. <laughs> you know what I like it about it? it the ginger me. Exactly. So this exactly. is so Ghanaian, right? Exactly. Yeah. So we're, we're Ghanaian today. Yes, we are. So yes, we are. I'm gonna have that because with you at Pioko and the um, model here, mm -hmm. I need a lot of energy. <laughs> Oh, wow. So I'm going to do that first before I do wine. Okay. I'll do the wine with the... Um, then perhaps we'll follow suit. Yeah. Okay, so while we're doing our salad... So cheers. Cheers. So good cheers. life, health. Cheers, cheers. Um, cheers. Friendship. Let's we'll just, we'll just pour our... And all the good things in mm. life. And money. And money. And Very life. important. Because you can money, get the money, money and die. Good. And good health. <laughs> oh. Are we set? Yeah. Cheers yeah. is important. Cheers, Cheers, ladies. Yeah, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. Yeah. So, hmm. this is good. The smell is good. It is. Very, so, um, Vivian, a yeah. lot of people see you on TV, hear you on radio, and they know you're a journalist. They know you, you're into business journalism. You do CNR and City TV. You host current affairs shows with so much finesse, <laughs> you know. Uh, we know that. But a lot of people don't know that you're actually the head of news. Okay. at City FM and City TV. And so there's a conversation that I want us to have precisely because, you're, you, I mean, you've been in the media for a long time. You've been doing mm -hmm. this how many years now? Um, so 15 or yeah. so. Yeah. Quite a long time. Yeah. Okay, but beyond that, you're also not just a media personality, but you're, you're into media administration. Mm -hmm. Okay, you're a leader in the yeah. media space. And uh, Magdalene I brought here because, I mean, as a model, <laughs> the topic we're going to discuss, you know, th this, this is very big. Social media, mm -hmm. okay? Yes. And we're specifically talking about how to comport yourself as a media person yeah. in the light of social media. And I mean, Maggie doesn't necessarily do news or anything like that, but she understands the media space just as well. Mm -hmm. So I I'm going to start by saying this. A lot of the time, especially in, in modern day, I mean, Vivian, you have said several times that and it, it's our mantra at City also that you, you don't break news anymore yeah. because social media breaks yeah. it. When people come to you though, they're looking for credibility, yeah. validation, mm -hmm. right? Validation, yeah. And we must make sure that we give that yeah. to them. Because most of the big stories we've seen over the period, mm -hmm. over the um, last two or three years, mm -hmm. were actually broken on social mm -hmm. media. 
So people are just coming to you to check, validate, mm. um, confirm mm. yeah. whether it's true or not Incredible. because some of them can really be, mm. you know, crazy stuff. So yeah. that's it. So y most of the news you see being broken start on social media okay. because let's say something happens now. Mm. Everybody is going to automatically take their phones right. without even calling any station mm. to say, oh, this is happening. Mm -hmm. They start, put it on social media before mm -hmm. they probably will call a station or call um, the police or whatever. That's right. where we've gotten to. And it's not just Ghana, everywhere. Okay. Yeah. That's true. Okay. What's so cooking? Oh, my, oh my God. Who is this gentleman in my house? <laughs> so, you know what? Wow. When my other friend called to say she wouldn't be able to make it. Yeah. Mm. Wow. I still thought, let's just put this plate here because there's a certain somebody who I had a feeling would show up because every time I go to eat, he shows up. Because when I I'm see... cooking, he shows up. And wow. he shows up when the food Uninvited? is ready. Uninvited. Wow. Wow. Uh, this food looks glamorous. But Taste General, Vivian don't play like that. She, you can't she just buy show up in my house. You need to. <laughs> oh, she cooked the food? <laughs> Excuse <Of course>. me. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, that's why not to be rude, glamorous. take a seat. <laughs> yes, yes, yeah, and I also came with the order of the day, good day energy drink. Well, yeah. we're enjoying that. Oh, you that. brought your own. Yes. I'm glad you know there wasn't one for yeah. you. Because uh, I like it so much, I'm not even going to share with oh. you. Oh, yeah. And as I sit, you may as well serve me some salads. Because it's good. My dietitian will be happy I'm eating some salads. Well, you have a dietitian. Mm? Yes. Mm. And he knows that or she knows she'll be eating all over the place. Mm? Oh, all over the place. Yes. Uh, from what I'm but told, you, know you show what up. You put in the food. You oh, show right. up at places when you've not been anyway, invited. We're having a conversation about social media and how to comport yourself as a media entity or a personality there okay mm -hmm. oh. so my you, you guy, I'm going to come. Wine too, if you don't mind. oh we'll get to that but you can't well, drink you can the wine yourself. ahead of us hmm? you can't drink the wine ahead of us okay. oh. <laughs> this is your friend oh it's, it's normal he's so rude so <laughs> <laughs> very he is very so magdalene mm -hmm. i mean every so often we hear news a lot of the time not so positive yeah popping up about media personalities entities and a lot of it is generated from social media yeah. now yeah. you are a model mm -hmm. and there are also thin lines there as well yeah. you know and it can even affect the kinds of gigs you, you get, get depending on how you project yourself and you're also very familiar with social media you, yeah. know, you used to blog and yeah. all that yeah. so what do you think and before i come back to vivian and mm -hmm. um, people need to be mindful of as people who work in the media space when they especially if you're working for a media house like city you know how do you still get your clicks your rec your recognition reach out to your audiences effectively without mm -hmm. compromising the integrity of your, your brand exactly i would say that first of all you should know the brand that you represent, the mm -hmm. brand that you are with, and see what, what it stands for. What are the objectives of your brand? What, what do you do and what do you not do as a brand? Do you quickly just hear something, go on social media, put it, or find something on social media, and quickly come and put it on your brand's uh, website or put it on your social media, or you take your time go through all the specific checks you need to do mm. make sure it's validated and credible enough before you come out as a media house to say okay we've heard this we've gone through the checks we think it is what it is mm. i think that that's the only way that this this whole issue of social uh, breaking news on social media would 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 be solved. Most people are looking, no, it's what it is. Mm. Because that, the, uh, with journalism, there are ethics, ethics there are rules, that exactly. we have all mm. that. Yeah. And one of the basic things to do in journalism is to cross check, check. your facts mm. before you press. Yeah. Fact checking. So we have what we say first to That's press, right. but with accuracy. Mm -hmm. So if I had, um, Apioko had been uh, appointed as the Minister of Health 
from, let's say, wherever, let's say social media. Mm -hmm. I don't go and put it on social media because I saw it on uh, Tessa General's um, page. You know, page. Mm -hmm. I have to go to the right authorities to confirm. Mm -hmm. I don't say I'm going to put it out there because I need to be the first the to first publish. To break it. And, and when it turns out wrong, what happens? So why I'm saying that people um, really are not practicing journalism, Journalism is about trust, it's about reputation, these exactly. two things. Mm -hmm. The moment you lose the two, nobody comes to you. Yeah. So if you really are a journalist, you know, I tell a story today is not true, I tell it's not true tomorrow, I tell the third time, yeah. that's the nobody trust form. That's the reputation, you know, okay. eroded. So you cannot afford to have that because remember you're in business. Exactly. And the, the main aim of this is to, you know, Impact. be credible and all that for advertisers to come to you because everybody will be tuning to so you to get the facts right. Exactly. Exactly. So most people just want the eyeballs, they want to have the uh, clickbait the, the click the and all yeah. that and they don't care which lens they'll go. Mm -hmm. So it gets to a point where these people you're talking about, mm -hmm. nobody bothers to, listen to, to them, you know, yeah. and that's your business gone, mm -hmm. you know. So if people are really practicing journalism, they go with the ethics and all the rules around journalism, and that's it. You know, journalism is a very uh, difficult, you know, sector, especially now that social media is ruling the media yeah. space, whether mm -hmm. we like it or, or not. not. Okay, sorry not to catch you, but I don't want us to miss out on eating the rest of the wonderful yes. food on yes. camera. The model is doing their own thing. Mm, so am I, but so we are not here to play. <laughs> you know, I'm a so, very slow eater. Yeah, so I'm going to give you a bit of the okay. couscous. Mm -hmm. So the couscous. And then this the This is just wolfing it down, wolfing it down. This is, are you I'm enjoying told? it? Yes, yes. Um, the leaves. Are you a fan of salad? Yes, yes. Oh, you do? Oh. He's mm -hmm. a salad oh, okay. person. Oh, okay. Okay. Yes. That's so often the uh, saladios. Salad. That's what you call it. Mm. Salad. <laughs> so I've given you tiny Thank portions you. since Thank you're you. not a Thank heavy you. eater. This Thank is your you. friend. Your neighbor, neighbor is really interesting. My neighbor. My neighbor. <laughs> mm. My neighbor. Models don't eat much, right? No, no, no. So that's, that's fine. I just give you. Mm. I can see you like um, prawns. So. I love it. I'm a seafood person. Mm. Oh, okay. Mm. okay. okay. You're a seafood person too? No, no, no. Oh, okay. I, I think the, so uh, I shouldn't give you the prawns? Yes, I, I think I like this one. Hey, you've already seen that. Oh. Yeah. Like, do you want the um, lamb chops? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Just lamb. Can do that, lamb. that very can do little, lamb. little one. The okay. lamb chops. This is the, the Lamborghini. That, we don't ah. have any tiny one. Oh, let me see. Okay. Yeah. Is there a tiny That's the second. If there's no tiny one, Should please. Oh, it's eat fine. the prawns. That's fine. Okay. Eat the can, prawns. can we, so that I, if you don't want a big one, I'll just give it to him. Since yeah. that's yes. what he wants. Mm -hmm. He came yes. for the food. This is not even Clearly. Mm -hmm. Well, you can have more if it's not enough. Yes. Give me some potatoes, more potatoes, yes. Wow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, so as a follow-up, Vinny has spoken a lot about journalism. Maggie as well, you've touched on, you mm -hmm. know, uh, the, the bigger media entity. Mm -hmm. as, so as, as a media, media house or anything like that. But let's talk about the individuals. <laughs> so the journalists, the, the presenters, yeah, even producers. people who work behind the scenes, scenes exactly. mm -hmm. you know, people who do sales. Because mm -hmm. media entity, people think you, you only just see the final TV. product mm -hmm. or hear the final product, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. But there's a lot that goes on behind you. Here on set, we've got a whole team here of, you know, how many people. Oh mm -hmm. From producer to director to camera operators, mm -hmm. technical people, sound engineer, they're all here, yeah. right? Now, let's talk about how as an individual working with a media brand. Because you see, once you are putting out information on behalf of your oh, media yeah. entity, people get to know that you work yeah, with exactly. a media house. Mm -hmm. So how do you now comport yourself as that individual, mm -hmm. as a representation, as an extension of the brand? So I'll start with you, Maggie. I think like, it, it still comes back to what I said, knowing what brand you stand for. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So you see a lot of um, negative things trending, whatever, mm -hmm. whatever. You see a lot of people who are yeah, now. celebrities, whatever. Mm -hmm. If you follow what they are doing, really, they are not doing anything. anything. That's true. There's no, mm -hmm. um, no talent substance. thing, mm -hmm. you know, <laughs> going on. Can you help it? But, that um, 
Yes. But we're in the garden, it's fine. I mean, let it enjoy. It's not harmful, so it's no, fine. I, I don't want you to get black spots. Well, yeah, I know. wouldn't. So, you, you know, know, you have okay, people you. who are not really heavy on the substance mm. thing, but they are the ones who are getting the attention. Yes. They are the ones people yeah. want to watch. Mm -hmm. They are the ones people yeah. want to listen to. Too. And it, you, you cringe because they are now directing our children, mm. our loved ones, you know, all that yeah. to what, what should is right and what is wrong mm. and all that. that. So that's the reality of, of where we've gotten mm. to. But I think everybody has their values, what they want to achieve in life and all that. Right. And if you have a reputation to, to protect, protect, you have a brand to protect, mm -hmm. you're mindful of all these things and you stray away from that kind of attention, which That's for now will look good, beautiful or whatever, but yeah, after later. you know some years, mm -hmm. it wouldn't look yeah. good on you. Mm -hmm. So you see all these trends and mm -hmm. all these people, but, and, and honestly, maybe I'm too old. It doesn't really g <laughs> get I my attention. So. In Do you mind telling people how old you are? Well, I'm 40. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. And it, so I don't know. When, <laughs> and when I was young, I, I don't know, maybe yeah. I, I'm the last born. So I probably, because of the <laughs> adult, yeah. yeah. And I so I, no. I, you know, right. early, but. But I'm considerably younger than you. I mean, I'm 33. Magazine is 35, yeah. but does it get to no. you? No, 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 no it doesn't. No. And uh, for uh, some years back, I remember when I was, I mean, doing active, active modeling. There was this company in the UK that got in touch with, I, I think I pure call remember the story, got in touch with me and said, you know what? We love your physique, mm. we love your figure, mm. everything, your mm. bone structure, everything is perfect for a brand that we want to launch. It was a skin product, but, you're too dark. but there's one thing. <laughs> I remember that. We want you to bleach your skin. And I was like, you know what? This is Magdalene yeah. Williams. Mm. I'm not going to compromise on that. It's either you take me like this or you go with your money and it, it somebody was, was a big, yeah it was it was like hundred thousand yeah. dollars this no four it's years pounds. Of, somebody pounds, would pounds, have. Yeah. pounds you see somebody oh. would somebody have. would have yeah. and and suffer the consequences later yeah. and i don't think we should we we, we should i, I don't think they think. care I, I think so because I don't think they want on they social want media. People yeah. are in a hurry to become famous. famous. People That's are in true. a hurry to get influence. People are in a hurry to be powerful. So, That's yes. the reality of the life where we've got into. Absolutely. And true. they will do anything, anything and everything to, to get, get it. There. See, That's so, what it is. So, what I tell, especially young people and women, especially um, when I get to meet them, is the internet never forgets. Yeah. So It'll you can do yes, mm -hmm. you can do all you want to do today. And social media is such a powerful yeah, internet yeah. tool and very far reaching. And you can do whatever you want to do today. But tomorrow, mm -hmm. in five years, in ten years, when you remember. want to land a job somewhere, mm -hmm. they will a pull up your social somewhere. media. Because now employers are looking at social That's media yeah. to to add to the things that they consider mm -hmm. when they are hiring people. people. What we in the media space are doing now, uh, let's say ten years back. People only use like Facebook to just highlight where they went to have fun yeah. and all that. But now, over the years, you see that Facebook reminds you of the things you did. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so if Five it was in ago, negative yeah. light, it will affect you. Absolutely. Your, especially when you now have a direction mm -hmm. for your brand or for yourself, what you want to oh, achieve. Absolutely. You understand? So yeah. um, I think if we had these ideas earlier, that look, this is a serious platform. Mm. Let it not be something to highlight the negative aspect of whatever we do, but rather project and the inspire positives. other people. Was, and and that is also why some people slay on their social media. Mm. Meanwhile, they don't, they slay don't, things. yeah, the slave they're not there yet. But it's become a thing, such a, a tool thing to settle scores, mm. such a tool to be so negative just to become popular. And yeah. and I go back to the same thing about. You guys will think, oh, it's not cool and all that, but they think it's fine. We've seen celebrities who deliberately go on social media, insult so each other, yeah. and trend. Oh. And the next week, the human beings forget <laughs> that these people are poor examples of society. Mm -hmm. And then they, they, they follow them, they, endorse, they give them the endorsement mm -hmm. deal. And Where so you that? say to yourself, the little person or the upcoming person 
who needs a uh, direction, papa, you know, role model. Mm -hmm. And this is what they are saying. They are seeing um, bad being endorsed, being encouraged. Mm -hmm. Well, what happens? So, I mean, <laughs> um, sorry, I mean, we're, we're in a garden and they're, they're also... But well, you want to run? No, this <laughs> well, say, sir, general. I felt like I a bullet hit general. me. General, we need your, your, your verdict. I felt a bullet hit me. <laughs> did you did you your verdict? Yes. <laughs> did you need your verdict? I, 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 I think that uh, uh, Madam Vivian has done something there because I'm seeing some cabbage that is colored and all that. What's the name of it? Red cabbage. Red. Yes, but it's sir. violet. Well, well, what a, what a we didn't that's, name that, it. That, that's, mm -hmm. that's the name. Yes, and we the salad is done the magic. And the couscous, we. Mm. I do couscous <laughs> and uh, you got a lot. Mm. It's nice. <laughs> From where? But the lamb chops, can you add more so that I can... No, eat. you didn't take it. Go ahead. Yeah, take it. Ah, we want your verdict, La. You've eaten enough to give a verdict. I said the food looks glamorous, mm -hmm. just like the one who prepared it. <laughs> So there's nothing more than glamorous eating. Ah, oh, okay. So, so it's a glamorous it. score. Yes, yes. <laughs> Above the rim. Yay! Yay! Thank you. I mean, it's, Vivian, it's, thank it's you so much for delicious. having me at short notice. <laughs> mm -hmm. and, and I mean, at short notice, but you, you've outdone yourself. Mm -hmm. And then also for allowing me to bring friends yeah. and even welcoming unwelcomed and uninvited I'm, I'm beginning ones. to like him, though. No, Aww. I mean, no, he's Everybody. sweet. He's a, you, Tyson General you. is a sweet neighbor, <laughs> but he you. just needs to stop bringing up surprises. When on you me. all the time. Yes, and I mean, thank <laughs> you for, for this conversation as well. I mean, maybe the last thing I'll say is that, um, and I'm sure you ladies would agree with me, and Tessa General as well, those of us in the media who feel that we have something to give to inspire. It's, it's a longer process. Yeah. The road is rocky, but uh, you stick and issue. trust the process. It can yeah. happen. And we also need to come out more. Mm -hmm. and because we mentioned the slave queen phenomenon, all these all negative press. Yeah. There's no yeah. bad press, all mm -hmm. that. But people out. are putting themselves mm -hmm. out there. Mm -hmm. Perhaps if we also put ourselves out there with, with what we consider. Take, take a bit of risk. Absolutely. Take a bit of absolutely. risk. Yeah. But do it in a way that we know we Positive want our, ch risk, our children yeah. and our grandchildren won't be embarrassed yeah, exactly. you know, later in life. Then perhaps we'll also be making the impact that we, we so desperately yeah. want to see social media making. I agree. And media personal personalities, women, men yeah, like yeah. us doing yeah. as well. That's right. Perfect. And thank I you agree. so much. And thank, thank you for coming. Thank I hope you, you enjoyed it. You're very the welcome. Oh, it's delicious. Wonderful meal. Absolutely wonderful meal. delicious. Wonderful thank you yeah. so, so much. this is What's Cooking. It has been What's Cooking and it always will be What's Cooking right here on City TV. My name is Apioko. Today I've been cooking with the Vivian Kailuko, head of news at City FM and City TV, um, presenter, anchor, extraordinaire, and clearly a cook in her own right, a chef on <laughs> the I'll see you next week. I'll be coming behind your walls now. Uh, <laughs> you pest. You yeah. pest. <laughs>